Right, folks, this is the last Beer Hawk sponsored video. And can I just say how happy and pleased I have been working with Beer Hawk on promoting their beers and gifts and everything. Um, I'm truly honored for it to be my first deal. Um, they might have me again, they might not, who knows? But whatever, thank you very much. And I hope I've got them some sales as well using the code BBM10. It's gonna be weird not saying that now. Use the code BBM10 for 10% off all deliveries to your door or anybody else's door who you might want to say it to, send it to. Um, ideal Christmas gifts. And talking of Christmas gifts, this is the last one. As you have seen from the thumbnail and the thumb title, the title, um, it is a yard of ale. There are eight crafty cans. Crafty, sneaky. You've got to be wary of these crafty things. Um, yeah, this is it, folks. Um, I'm going to review uh, not all eight cans, right? Because at the time of speaking, it is one o'clock. And... Um, yeah, I don't want to be drunk when Junie Baby comes home. Um, I get into enough shit without this as well. Uh, so, Beer Hawk, this case uh, cost £22, right? Um, using the code BBM, BBM10, you'll get 10% off. I'm like, look at me, I need a shave. Why is it right? When, I wear, when I've not had a shave and I look in the mirror, I think, oh, I'll have a shave tomorrow. That way it won't get in my mask at work and my bandana thing that I wear. And, uh, you know, cause sometimes my whiskers poke through and it catches them and it's sore. And I think, I'll leave it till tomorrow or I'll leave it till tonight. That way I'm working all weekend. It won't get snagged in my bandana. That's if I can be bothered to put it on half the time because I keep forgetting. And, um, yeah, but yeah, you come on the camera, not like bloody David Bellamy. Now you're all saying, who's David Bellamy? Well, he was a bloke who went in the jungle. Not the celebrity jungle. Or did he? He might have done. I don't know. Anyway, load of rubbish that. You're not really interested. So, what you do is, folks, um, the, 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 there is a... Right, what you do is, right, it says on it, uh, eight crafty cans, yard of ale. Uh, here at Beer Hall, we want to help you discover your next favourite beer. This one may be the one. There are thousands to choose from, and the bloody is thousands, you know. There, I'm not just saying that, because I've been sponsored and paid to do this. There's bloody thousands. Um, you've only got to go on the, B, on the beer, BVM website, the Beer Hall website, and you'll see it. There's thousands. Uh, imagine this, but times thousands. So we thought, how about gathering up eight of our best beers, stacking them sky high, and take you on a beer journey and then you've got a little road mark, some marks on there. Obviously you wouldn't be drinking and driving, you'd be looking, right? If you like going out for the night, or get a taxi, get a minibus, take the lads, all the lassies. Uh, welcome to our yard. So what you do is, it says open here. Hold on. For the visually impaired at the bottom of this box, it says open here for beery greatness. So I think what you do is you put your finger in, and then it's got like a little, the paper's been, card's been like, you know, it's like this, look, it's like that, you see, it's a bit like that, and then it's got like, where you rip it, yeah? Look at that, that's good that is, it's good. And then what you do, is you take out the beer that comes, and you just sample it. Do you know what? Oh, it's Lucas, I've already done that one, that's a good one. So, I don't want that one, because I've already done them. I like that one, that's a good one. Right, what's this one? Oh, we've got a new one, we've got a new one, folks. Got a new one. Ooh. What have we got? We've got Heart and Soul. Oh, we've got Pale Ale. What's that one? Oh, we've got a Yank original Yankee Pale Ale. Oh, hold on, I'm going to have to take all these out and have a look. 
So I've got Goose 312. It's not quite Austin 316, is it? It's Urban Wheat Ale, Goose Island. We've got Vocation Heart and Soul. Give a little bit of heart and soul. Give a little bit of love to pal. Uh, original Yankee Doodle Dandy, he, the Yankee Doodle Die. Uh, Roosters Brewing Company since 1993. It's got an alcoholic volume of 4.3%. Original Yankee Pale Ale. Soft Yorkshire Water. Yorkshire, like the tea. Um, malted barley wheat, hops and yeast. Hmm. What's this one? What's this? I one. Look at this. Look at this. Club Tropicana drinks are free. Goose Midway Session. Goose Beer Island. We don't need to be the only beer you drink. We just want to be the best beer you drink. I've had to stop starting because I actually read what I want to read and not what's there. Hunter, Triple H. Am I leaning out? I'll hide behind this. I can't see. My bloody glasses. Are, I've got to get proper glasses. I can't keep wearing these Wilco things. Oh, and we've got a Camden's pale out. Right, so what I'm going to do, folks, I'm going to put them back in. Goose Midway, that can uh, go back in. What's this one? Hunters, I like that one, so I've had that one before. I'm going to have this Yankee Doodle Dandy one. Uh, I'm not going to have the Club Tropicana drinks of three eight year in it now. Is it two years? Two years, isn't it, since Georgie's gone? Sad day that. My mate John Baggers, he, um, he used to model himself on uh, George Michael. And everything. The hair, the shoes, the clothes, the lot, right? Gutted when he died. Absolutely gutted. We had to take his shoelaces out. Right. I'm not gonna. What's this? I'm not gonna have that goose one. I'm gonna have that vocation, heart and soul. Let me just put these over here. Excuse my lounging shorts. It's me day off. I'm lounging. All right. In fact, I could do with a new pair of lounging shorts. I quite like lounging shorts. They're good. They're like you're comfy. You know what I mean? You're comfy. Uh, right. What I'm gonna do, folks? I'm gonna go for the give a little bit of heart and soul. Vocation Session IPA. It's 4.4% in volume. It's pineapple mango. Oh, shit. I hate pineapple. I like lilt, but I'm not a fan of pineapple. Not cleaning the glass out properly, folks. Sorry. My fault. Washing up. You know what it's like, bloke's washing up, get a rinse under the tap, gone, everybody's happy. Put it back in the cupboard, she won't know. Oh, it does smell fruity. Very tropical mango-y kind of pineapple-y thing. Now, some people might like that. <laughs> I cannot um, hide the fact that I'm not a pineapple fan. And I... <laughs> oh, blimey. <laughs> Sorry, beer all. I can't. If I don't like it, I can't. I can't do it, you know what I mean? Well, that's the way it goes. That's the good thing about these little cases you get. You try eight beers, you've got them, and then when you find out the one that you like, you order more. It's easy. I just apologise that the code BVM10 will be gone. Probably, I think the BVM code's finishing around. <coughs> Excuse me. It's a bit of gas. It's a bit gassy. Um, the code will be finishing uh, just before Christmas, so uh, there you go. There you go. You know what I mean? But fair play. Thank you to everybody who's used the code BVM10 and had all the home deliveries uh, of bottles and cans delivered to their door or to their loved ones. Oh, I do apologise. 
But if there's something you don't like, you can't do it. I can't eat olives. I can't eat olives. There's no way. If somebody gave me an olive beer, I couldn't do it. Now, let's have a look at this one. So the, the beer machine's there, the uh, perfect draft machine's just sitting there. It's there, I've got a couple of glasses, so if I do fancy some, I just don't. And it's there. Right, let's try this one. Uh, original Yankee Pale Ale, 4.3%. Uh, tasting notes, one of the original new style, original new? How can you have original new? Uh, new style pale ales to be brewed in the UK. Yankee is a modern, classic, light and easy drinking. It displays floral and citrus fruit aromas. <laughs> oh dear uh, oh a backdrop of soft Yorkshire water and golden promise of pale malt hops cascade right let's go for it oh my 10 minutes I've done that glass and all what I've not done it well you just rinse them out that's all you do isn't it this is wrong really because it could affect the beer. I love my mug. I love my mugs. Bloody brilliant. Proper beer mugs like from the 70s. Oh, I'd love to go back to the 70s. I'm not getting too much aromas of the uh, citrusy stuff but I just taste the beer. That just tastes of a real good pale ale, to be fair. I can't fault that. I wouldn't say it's the best beer I've ever drank. I wouldn't say I'd be ordering 100 cans using the code BBM10, but it's just a nice, simple beer. If somebody bought me a case of them for Christmas, I'd be quite happy. I'd be quite happy uh, supping away on the Yankee. I don't know whether the Yankee would mind me supping away on him, but there you go. Here. Yeah. Yankee. Bit like a candle. Bit like a candle, folks. Um, yeah. That's alright. No wrong with that one. I'd have another one of these. That's all right. I like that one. I like that one a lot. Uh, right, folks. So uh, let's just to wind this up. If you go onto the Beer Hawk website, they've got all kinds of gifts for Christmas. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. There you go. Uh, they've got yard of They've got all. They've got all these different kinds of selections of beers together, put together for you. So it, it's just. <laughs> Uh, postman's bill thing. Um, yeah, they've just got different kinds of things. So go on the Bear Hawk website, type in the code BBM10 for all bottles and uh, cans and these little gift sets. See if it works. Sometimes it will work, sometimes it won't. This stuff that's been heavily discounted, like the perfect draft machines, but I think they've all sold out because of me, and uh, that's the way it goes. Um, all right, folks, thank you once again for Bear Hawk. Get on there, just have a look. And even when I have um, finished my promotion, I'm going to go and have a shave. Even when my promotion has finished, still go on there and get yourself some great deals. Some people say that, you know, oh no, go and buy, go and go, go and get the rubbish from B and M then. Go and buy their beers. But if you want quality beers, you've got to go to Beer Hawk. They are absolutely excellent. I wouldn't tie my name to any old rubbish, you know. And Beer Hawk are not rubbish. They are good quality service. Uh, so right, nothing on the end. What's up with you, you stupid? Come here. Say bye. Bye. Laters.